to anybody in 12 weeks. There's nothing difficult or complicated about this. You know, can you can you get to a job on time? Can you make a good first impression with a client? Can you take down all the details of the property, even if you don't know what you're looking for? Can you get good notes and good photos that you can then go away in the peace and quiet of your office and work it out? You don't have to work it out on site. So you don't need that instant kind of knowledge. If you wanted to apply yourself outside of that environment, you could definitely do that. It's about all the things that you, you either have or don't have anyway, the work ethic and the communication skills. If you've got that, the rest of it is, it's all there for you. You, know, you just have to follow the model, which sounds really cliche, probably, and it's corporate, but it's true. Early early on, it was kind of presented that 200 grand's worth of turnover in year one is, is a good benchmark. I, I anticipated being able to do 250,000 worth of claims year one and based on the information given that you know the average claim is around ten thousand pounds that type of thing seemed seemed achievable knowing what i did know from a construction point of view i've been able to do better than that i'm at 46 claims signed up um, my average claim value is about twelve and a half thousand pounds and right now i'm at about four hundred and sixty thousand costs attributed to those claims um, i've got four or five of them that aren't um costed yet so actually all told it might get close to 500k so yeah i mean that's that's where it's at that's what is achievable i don't think that i have done anything different to what anybody else could do i've had far from optimal conditions for year one the lockdown hit four or five weeks after my training pandemic has done a couple of things to, for me one it's proven that the business can operate regardless nothing has really slowed the insurance and the Asprey side of the business down. The pandemic slowed the construction side down in the middle of the year, but that is nothing anyone could do about that. Unless something you know gets a lot worse than it currently is, which seems like it probably can't get much worse, it's not going to affect me really. Um, my business has grown from nothing to where it is now in one year, and I would be hugely disappointed if it doesn't continue to grow throughout year two. So if we've been able to achieve what we've done in year one with the restrictions we've had, then why can't we do better in year two? At the end of the day, you're not charging for your service. So whatever happens in a recession of the economy, people don't have to go put their hand in their pocket for this. It's just available to them.